Good day my friends, Walter here. A little bit on the disgusted side today, so I guess today's vlog is more of a rant. Last night this stupid sink started leaking around the drain again. I took out the original sink that was here a couple of years back and put in a stainless steel sink. My wife was over here cleaning the kitchen. We keep some pans and stuff under here. She said it was leaking. So we got everything all cleaned out. And I'm not, well I'll just hold the camera down there. I don't want to get down on my hands and knees. But this basket, probably not enough light in there, but that little trap that hooks on the bottom of the stainless steel sink is where the leak was coming from. Right around this strainer basket here. When you install this on the sink, you have to put plumber's putty around here. And this was installed two or three times. I never was real happy with it. A little research on the internet leads me to believe that a lot of people have had trouble with regular plumber's putty on a stainless steel sink. When it squeezes it down there and oozes out, it's supposed to seal. But I don't think it seals very good on stainless steel. And I'm downright disgusted about it, so uh, the temporary solution is not to use this side of the sink. We went ahead and ran the dishwasher and everything last night, and there's no problem under there then, as long as we had it, no water going in here. I might have to put silicone around this thing when I put in, I was going to go just take it out and I tried tightening it a little bit, but that didn't seem to help. But I was going to just take it out and put some more plumber's putty in there. I got that right here. But I've went this route one time before. This ain't the first time I've had trouble with this stupid sink leaking. So i got to find a better solution to seal that strainer basket. I don't even want to get down on my hands and knees and work on the darn thing today. So... What I've done is oh, that don't need to be in there. Put that in there. You just put a plate in there with a no on it and don't run no water on this side. <laughs> That's my solution for today. What I'm gonna do is go to one of the building supply stores and get a a new strainer basket, possibly a different kind and put it in there. We used to have trouble with this side leaking all the time because it didn't properly hook up. I finally got the right plumbing attachments on there to work that. But I really wish I'd have never put a stainless steel sink in this kitchen. They are a pain in the petunia. My solution is to sit back and look at it for a day or two and think about it. <laughs> I'm gonna go out on the porch and wait for the wife to get home from her hairdresser's appointment. And then maybe I'll go over to Lowe's and see what I can find. Or Home Depot or somewhere. But I got one more rant to talk about. I'm going to go out on the porch to talk about it. 